Hello everybody, welcome to Colorful Diary. How are you? Are you already on your vacations or are you waiting for your vacations? Um, I have some news to tell you. First one is that um, I'm going on vacations. I can't wait. I'm going to Croatia. Um, in the same place that I was last year. Um, and the other news, news, or how? The other news, yes. <laughs> the other news is um, that I finally got my job. So now maybe we will have uh, more videos. Um, more things to test and so on. So now that I said everything that I wanted, um, we can go on our finished pages um, and take a look at the pages that I colored in June. I will open this um, my coloring journal and will let uh, leave it here aside um, so I can see what mediums and other stuff did I used. So now let's take a look on my pages. Today the first page will be a freebie and a PDF. <laughs> um, this page is by Agota Pop. Agota Pop. I don't know how to pronounce it correctly. Um, it's a simple and really cute page. Um, here I used just Spectrum Noir, Noir color blends that I really neglected and I said what if I just take them out and try um, any page so I did this one this was the um, last seconds <laughs> finished because I had one body color with Disney Max coloring and she sadly didn't finish her page yet so I needed um, a new page I mean I didn't need it but I like to have um, 8 pages per month um, don't ask me why, I don't know, <laughs> but I like to have it. Um, if there is more pages, nothing wrong, but yeah. And it's only pencils, nothing else. Or maybe you can see something else, because you see these white lines. Um, I didn't ex expect that it will be that visible. Um, this paper was already used for one page. I mean, it didn't print all, but just a part. You, I will show you. And I didn't want that didn't want to um, throw that paper in the trash so I reused it on the other side but sadly this paper is not that thick um, as the other ones that I usually have but I mean if I 
if I would um, add some background or, or something, it would be nice. I mean, it wouldn't be visible, but I just wanted to leave it like that, blank. I mean, white. <laughs> um, but now it is what it is, so I can't help it. I tried to, um, when I was posting a page, I tried to hide that part here. I managed to hide it somehow, not 100%, but I kinda hide it. So, you see what was printed? This. This is from some matchstick, matchstick mouse, I think. But yeah, that was... It was visible here and... <sighs> what can we do? <laughs> I can make a closer look. And I enjoyed coloring this page. It's cute. So this is um, my this these are my birds in heart shape <laughs> um, by Agota Pop. Next one we have Boil de Pois. If I said it correctly, um, this is um, group body color book. Um, me and Lovela are having um, hashtag on Instagram. Um, each month we choose a page. <laughs> Somehow um all the time ends up that i choose a page so <laughs> yeah but yeah, it's our color along um each month we select other page um and this month was oh no <laughs> not this one <laughs> was this one cute little authors and here I used only Prisma colors for everything and white Posca and white um, Sakura Jelly Roll. And that's everything that I used here. For this page I knew I want something different with the leaves because usually I have um, all the time I have uh, just one color combination for green that I really like um, and then I'm using it almost in every page um, but here I wanted something something else something different some different kind of green and this is the aqua green and it turned out really good. Um, so now those um, authors are, are standing standing a little bit out. Um, I added a lot of dots for a shiny water. Yeah. Here I will show you Lovela's page. Her pages are, I mean, our body colors. Um, they are always turning out amazing. I love her. Her finished works are incredible. Um, now I will share you share with you um, others, other pages that were joining that's joined in our color along so I will leave you some pictures and then we will go on to the next book next we have 
Worlds of Wonder by Joanna Basford. Um, and here I did, I forgot to tag them, so we will need to find it, but where it is? It's this one. <laughs> um, maybe you were watching my plans for May and June. And you saw that page. I selected it. Um, and I knew what I want to do with the background, with stars, with flamingos. I didn't have didn't had idea what to do with houses so I did everything that I knew how I wanted to color it and then I was thinking and thinking and thinking and then decided that buildings can be brown and then I was thinking about the roofs if they should be gold too or no or, or not and I just make them make them in dark brown and some of them have here some gold accents but that's everything flamingos are colored with I'm sure for this one that is um, watercolor from Aliexpress and I can show you the um I can show you which color um which pens are those not pens colors <laughs> they come in a pack of six or some of them are a pack of eight um those ones are glued on on this so when I will use every every single color then i can just throw it away um, for the background i used black posca then gold signo prisma colors and this is the other watercolor those are the, this is the package for this shiny um, flamingo it's primo and here I got five neon and seven metallic watercolors I just need to open it oh it took me a while and this is this one and those are not like those from Aliexpress, but I, I I think they have some kind of glitters in it, you see, here on the... And if I show you now this flamingo from the... from here, you can see some glitters in it. Yeah, and then I used um, washi tape for on the bottom and on the top. I wanted to um, add it here too, but um, it looked so a lot of shine, so I just left these two, and it's enough. It would be too much if there would be um, some washi on those two sides sides too so this is the enough <laughs> um and yeah so this is my page from worlds of wonder by joanna basford
Next one we have Gnome Sweet Gnome by Teresa Goodrich. And I did this page. Oops. Um, here I used alcohol markers for the base and then Prisma colors on top, some black Sakura glaze, um, clear Sakura jelly roll. Here I used um, Stary Colors by Ganzai Tambi. I used black, not black, um, white Sakura Jelly Roll, Gold Signo, and for the center of the flowers, then white uh, Jelly Roll for the dots, and for the picnic blanket or something that we use on picnics um, I used acrylic markers from Sheen um, I said I will make a video about them I will I just uh, need to find some good page for for those markers because I tried um, coloring, colored. I tried to color on top of markers, and I know it didn't work well. So, but I will. I will make a video just for you to see how those markers are working. They are not um, really opaque for the. Um, lines, but for me they're working as much as I'm using them. For me they are working really well. So these are my sweet gnomes. <laughs> Summerish with the watermelons. Yeah, this is Gnome Sweet Gnome by Teresa Goodrich. Then we have my creative book. Um, as you already maybe saw in any video before, I said that this is my creative book when I, where I'm using all kind of um, all kind of stuff that I have. If I want to shade, I shade. If I don't like it, then I don't shade it. As well, not all the pages are for me. I mean, I don't like all the pages in here, but I will try to color them. Um, I have uh, now acrylic markers, so I can kind of um, go over the lines and hide them. And just got the idea, maybe I can test um, with you, uh, test um, those acrylic markers in this book where I can be creative and just try to shade them and so on. And here I did this page, flamingos again. I did two pages of flamingos, why? Because um, I had um, hashtag on Instagram, Flamingo in July. Maybe I can show you some pictures of Flamingo pages too. Um, I have a hashtag in this month, in July too. And this month we will color lemons. So, again, here I used those... Um, watercolors from Aliexpress um, for the dark um, um, flamingos it's Aliexpress it's this shiny pink and the other one is the same uh, watercolor that I um, used on previous page that I'm I was showing you which watercolors did I used for the water I used two 
um, two different shades of blue again from the watercolors from aliexpress that are those shiny um, and for the background i used um, koinor watercolors and then for the stars and dots i used um, sakura jelly roll and for their eyes i used sakura glaze in black and this is my finished page and i liked it a lot when it was done so for example here we have a page that it's not really my style but maybe with some um acrylic markers i could color these kind of pages but we'll see we'll see what time will bring us so this is my finished page of flamingos in fantastic animals by fabrizio spadini next one is another body color in Minerize Durch Europa by Rita Berman and it's this one this was a body color with I will show you a body color with Le Petit Atelier de Carine or de Carine I don't know how to pronounce it um, but yeah this was our page I used only Prismacolors clear jelly roll Sakura jelly roll um, white jelly roll and Stary watercolors by Ganzai Tambi for this part here for those dots on these two fishes and this line these pink lines on this fish I used acrylic markers from Sheen and I used Sakura uh, clear glaze on the not on his head but on on this part and on the watch um, this silver parts on the diver was with um, silver prismacolor it's not a gel pen it's just pencil well yeah I like it um, here I will show you Kavia's page it's the water is kind of similar I think but I like her version really it's nice so this is my page from Minerize Durch Europa by Rita Berman next we have nice little nice little town six by Tanya Bogema Stalova and this was body color two this page was a body color um, with coloring bumblebee I will show you her page here and our pages are <laughs> really different her is bright just like you would open the window and look to the sun it's so bright um i think she said she used alcohol markers and then just a little bit of shading um to add some dimension and i used um alcohol markers too and then prisma colors on top for the background i used um jackson aquarels 
Ähm, und Spoons I used Stary Colors by Gansai Tambi and here as well and on those um, detail on the lines as well. On the center of the flowers I used Signo Gold and on and on those lanterns. Um, but this is basically it. Prisma colors and some shiny water colors and that's it and some white um, gel pen sakura jelly roll on here just to make a little bit shine on this details and on his head and here on the curtain but that's basically it i like it so this is my page from Nice Little Town 6 by Tanya Bogima Stalova. And the last and the last page for this month was in Fantastic World or Fantastic Worlds, I don't know, by Alessandra Fusi. This is almost brand new book. It came out in April, but I bought it in store in which month? Oh, I didn't write it out. I will check it in here. I bought this book in February, <laughs> but colored in it in June. So four months. This book was waiting for me four months. Um, and I colored this orchid girl. I will show you first this part because there is just flowers and some parts of the tree. And here is the main character. My cute girl with a heavy makeup. <laughs> if you can see, she here she has a really dark um, shadowing and red lips. Wait, I can show you like that. You see? <laughs> she has a very heavy makeup. Um, here I used Mungio Soft Pastels for the background and for the bubbles I used Signo Silver Gel Pen. Everything else is in Prisma Colors. That's it. I was playing with some colors on her dress and for her, let's say, that are shoes. <laughs> um, and it came out really, really nice. I hope I will color some more in this book, but every page that I would like to color is a double page spread, so we'll see. But this is my finished page for June in Fantastical Worlds by Alessandra Fusi. Um, I wish you very happy month, colorful month. Um, if you are going um, on your vacations, enjoy it in every second. And we will see each other in the next video or if you are not watching any other videos except finished pages, we will see you. We will see you in next finished pages. Happy coloring and... Bye!